I welcome you to this video. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to run your first ad if you are using your page for the first time. This is my page. I just created it and I've never used it to run ad before. So this particular ad I want to set up now is the first ad. Let me walk you guys through how you can set up your first ad as you can see currently we have six followers like i always advise my student don't run ad with zero followers you need followers so that facebook can trust you they can know that you are a genuine business if you are running ad with zero followers it can lead to your page being restricted from running ad so make sure you invite your friends to like your page to follow your page now i invited my friends before and now i have six followers i have five likes but that is not enough yet i still need more followers to gain that trust from facebook algorithm so what i will do now is i will simply go to my ad manager in my previous video, I show you guys how to add your page and your Instagram page, your Facebook page and Instagram page to your business manager account. Now, this is the account I want to use. This is the ad account I want to use for this page. You can see there is no ad yet. I will simply hit on create. There is, we need to confirm few details about your account before you can publish an ad. Okay, let's click on this. A page is required to run ad. It will appear in your ad as the brand. Okay, let's click on use this particular page. Confirm. Then what else? Get set up to run ad. Let's click continue. This ad, I want to use page like or follow. So that is why I select engagement, continue. And I will set it to manual. Continue. Add payment. Let's leave this for now. Let's give our campaign a name engagement i add a g so that each time i see it i'll know that it's engagement objective then we move to ad set you can click on asset or you click on next to take you to ad set anyone here we give it a name we add engagement to it then we also add a country we are targeting, we add audience we are targeting, civil engineer. Then we add the date so that if we see it, we quickly know when we created it, the audience we are targeting. Okay, everything is there. The objective, the country, the audience and the date. And sometimes the amount we are spending per day. I will be spending 3,000 naira per day. So let me add that. Facebook page. This will represent your business in your ad conversion. Let's click on destination. On destination should be page. If you don't select this, it will not show page like. Now the page like is this, the amount we want to spend per day, let's make it 3,000 Naira, daily budget, then for location, let's leave it at Nigeria, let's switch to original audience, switch to original audience, now the age, Let's increase the age, the lowest age to 24 and the highest to something like 
55. Then for the detailed targeting, we want to target specific audience. So detailed targeting, let's click edit. Let's search for civil engineer. Civil engineer, let's look for interest. Those that are interested in civil engineer, civil engineering interests. Let's select these. We have 1 million to 1.3 million people. That's a good audience. Let's save this audience. Let's give it a name civil. NG Nigeria. Let's save it. Now we can go to add set now. Let's give it a name. Let's uncheck this. Let's add our creative. We actually need this website event. We need this. But for now, we don't have website yet. So let's leave that for now. We'll soon create our website, our free website. I'll show you guys how you can create your free website. Okay, let's work on the ad creative. Let's add video. Primary text. Let's add something like just very simple. I prefer to write my primary text in Notepad because of some issues. Probably structure for beginners, and that is all. Very simple, add creative. Probably structure for beginners. This is specifically designed for civil engineers. Connect with us to learn more. Okay, very simple. then i'm going to paste it here okay i think this one this is suggested by meta ai this look great okay let's use that let's use this let's click next let me copy it to somewhere else in case something happened so this is another version of, of it this was this was suggested by Meta AI, which is cool. Let's click next. Let's upload. It's uploading now. It is done uploading. So I select it, click done. You see the preview here. So as it is now, people will just hit this like button. If they like it, they hit the like button and that is it. I need to work on the thumbnail. To work on the thumbnail, simply click on edit video, select the thumbnail, click manual, click upload. I already designed the thumbnail in Canva and make sure the size of the thumbnail should be minimum of 600 pixel. One of the side must be minimum of 600 pixel. It shouldn't be less than 600 pixel. Then let's click done. We we'll click save. A video is required. Add a creative. Okay, I think now you see that there is no primary text. That's why we had to copy that time. So I can go and grab this one now. Let's paste it. We are done. So I am going to publish it now. Okay, let's publish it. All right, so it's asking us to add money to our account. And this is okay. We'll leave it at Naira, Nigeria. 
Lagos, Africa. Let's click next. At this point, I want you to select pay you if you are in Nigeria. If you are not in Nigeria, your own option will be there. Let's click next. Let's leave this but let's keep it the amount we want to add is ten thousand naira let's click next open continue i'm expecting an otp now one time password phone is added let's click done and now the ad is published now oh you see your ad wasn't published because it has error let's view details please authenticate your account due to recent activity eg login location we think that someone may have tried to access your account without permission to be saved your ad won't run until you authenticate your account okay let's see i later contacted the Facebook support team and one of them assisted me to fix that error now you can see the ad is active now and I even added an image ad creative to it so that as the video is going the image is also going it helped me to save cost so that is how you can set up your first ad if you are using a new page I hope you benefit a lot from this. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.